Hey guys, this is uh, me, Cycle Hunter, uh, doing, I guess, a little explanation of what's been going on with this channel lately. Um, when I started this whole thing, I didn't expect for how it went up. I just started with app games and stuff because I didn't have the equipment that I have now. Um, my audio was shit. My uh, video quality was shit. Um, everything, everything was just bad about my videos at that time. But then when I got to Bad Boys Girl, out of me being in the most horrible depression I've ever been in, it got me out of it. Um, not just because. Uh, views or anything like that it was because some people were actually supporting me and I felt support and everything left and right but I felt like that also made me grow a little bit of an ego because um, I do remember there was one um, there was one uh, comment saying like oh stop thinking that you're a big youtuber no one cares blah, blah, blah. because I honestly I cared about my upload times at the time and I really wanted to keep you guys updated too but I guess I don't remember how I responded to it but I did respond saying that some people do actually care because it's this videos that they watched I think it was Gotcha World that I was mentioning um but I, I know I said it in a good way but I will admit that my that it was an ego thing when I was making that comment back to him and I've done I've done it a lot before and I want to apologize real quick about that because um, though I my comments make it sound like it's a good thing I don't know if anyone's seen them but every time I make a comment like towards a negative one like that for some reason to me I'm thinking it's me boosting my ego in general and I feel bad about that and I am so sorry um I don't I don't know. It, it really bugs me now because now I'm thinking I'm probably over exaggerating. But at the same time, I I just want to say I'm sorry because um, this is what's gonna this is what I'm getting into next right now. Um, ever since Bad Boys Girl ended, um, I guess you could say my ego thing made it a little bit worse with me doing YouTube because after Bad Boys Girl, I was sort of in a panic, just looking for anything to upload, just to hope there were gonna be views. And they weren't getting as many views as what Bad Boys Girl did, which I was really hoping that they would, but they weren't. And I was like, fuck. Like, I was in panic, and I was thinking these videos aren't cutting it. Cancel, 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 cancel. I remember that that was the whole freaking thing that I was doing. That's, that's the whole thing I've been doing, sadly. I've been canceling this, canceling this, canceling this, canceling this. Like, all these series that I've done have immediately got canceled because... They weren't doing anything for me. Like, they weren't getting views or anything. The only thing I didn't cancel was Kingdom Hearts because I was determined to get that out because I wasted so much time of my life on it. Um, but everything else just... I don't know. For some reason, um, I'm just not entertaining when I do my console games. And I've, I've looked back on them. I'm not. I'm very quiet i let the video game do its talking and the video game doesn't even give me a lot of time to actually talk to then i can do some comments so i do understand why people don't watch it and i'm sorry that i tried pushing that stuff out just to see if some people would watch it i mean i had fun recording it but it gets back to uh, is it, get, it okay so let me explain this real quick because i don't know if i did it on this take um when i did bad boys girl or even other like app games there was a process thing. There was like a three-step thing for me. It was upload, edit, send. All three of those times for Bad Boys Girl, I was excited or I had fun. I had fun recording Bad Boys Girl. I had fun editing, and I was excited to see everyone's reaction to the edit to the edited footage that I did for Bad Boys Girl. And then when I released it, I was so excited to see what y'all guys would say. Now. What I feel with doing console games is just have fun recording it and then drag myself editing it to where I just want to get it done and then just say fuck it, send it, I don't care. Usually because I went back and started looking back at all my footages after I think a bad 
version of Bad Boys Girl was released or something like that. Um, I looked back at it and it, yeah, no, it was, it was horrible. It was the worst thing I ever made. And I, or I guess to me, it was the worst thing. Now I'm really thinking about it, but I just, I didn't like it. So that's where I started doing a lot of backup checks. But after doing these console games, I just wanted to get them done and over with. Um, and I think that goes to where the next part of this story goes. Um, because of that, like, the whole three system with the consoles, with me just dragging stuff, I made me lose motivation to even edit a video at that point. I had so much console footage on my, con on my uh, laptop that I just don't want to edit because I'm just like, what what's the point? No one's going to watch it. Like, that's, that's how bad it is. And it, I'm not saying that's y'all's fault. I'm saying because literally, I'm not that funny on a console game. And I'm not saying, oh, that's, uh, y'all guys told me to play console. Because no one did. No one told me to play console except my friends because they want to be on YouTube as well. But because of their audio that's so bad for me to even try to edit, um, it's hard to, it's really hard to edit with their audio for me. And I just don't have any idea because they're static and the playback is just so distracting I guess I would word it just very distracting so I just stopped uh, even bothering to edit things until I got to a game called um, Coffee Talk um, Coffee Talk is something that's not it, like I do have some hope in it but at the same time the console thing is sort of killing me because I'm, I am having fun editing it, but right when I get to the end, it's just for some reason I feel like I want to drag. I just want to drag it, just to drag it the fuck out instead of being perfect on it. That's that's why there hasn't been another video in a couple months. Yeah, now getting to where I am now, um, I am no longer working. Uh, the main problem would be even also continuing this stuff was work as well because my work throughout um the whole time that i've been doing this whole random upload crap has been killing me it's been killing me very immensely because work i was focusing too much on it and apparently just this year i had a mental breakdown in the, my restroom i was uh crouched down i was pretty much rocking back and forth and i i was laughing maniacally i was laughing as if i was the Joker or some shit. It was it was very frightening for me to experience because I I just didn't like that feeling and I've had multiple ones lately either at work or at um at just the store in general when I went to Walmart with my mom uh, the past two times for some reason I had this weird urge to get the hell out and for some reason I was thinking oh they won't let me out unless I buy something when that's that's not true. Uh, so, because of that, I quit my job because I felt like I just wasn't able to cut it. I was calling in every fucking week. I just wanted to be home. I just wanted to be home. I just wanted to be home. I don't want to be around people, blah, 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 or whatever. I don't know if that's being with a phobia. I don't know if it's being mental problems or what, but I just did not want to be around people because I did. I was afraid people would see me laughing maniacally like the fucking Joker out of nowhere and me have a mental breakdown rocking it in the middle of the fucking store like it, it was that bad um so because of this I now don't know if I can't work but this also popped an idea in my head as well um I am going to try and attempt to do YouTube as a full-time job. I'm gonna try doing the weekly thing that I used to do, uh, doing them every Sunday, and who knows, maybe if I can do more, I can do more on another day. Um, but I hope that I can get back into it. Um, I can't promise any uploads this Sunday, though, uh, this on the 6th, because right now we are currently moving because due to me leaving my job, um, it made things a little bit worse with my family and the so we're moving somewhere to where we'll be for a little while and all honesty this video is not to explain or not to 
fully just be like, oh, I'm so easy. I'm not looking for apology acceptances or anything like that, even though I doubt that's what people got from what I said in the first 10 minutes, but I'm not looking for that. I'm not looking to make excuses. I fucked up. My uh, mental health is fucked up to where it's made me be a horrible channel <laughs> channel member <laughs> of this thing. I guess that's what they call myself. I don't know. But um, it, it's it's been bad and I really am sorry to have wasted a lot of people's time. I want to say thank y'all just mainly because uh, the fact that I still have 530 of y'all still here. I know not the full 500 is watching, but it still means a lot to me to know that there are some people still interested. And I hope, I hope I don't let you guys down. I really just want to get back into doing this because I remember doing Bad Boys Girl. A lot of people were saying that that, that those videos were, um, we're hoping them get out of bad times. And it's... That's what made me really continue doing Bad Boys Girl, and that's what made me excited because I really wanted to help people that are in this void that I'm even in right now. I really wanted to help people with it, and that's another reason why I appreciate Bad Boys Girl because when I first made that episode, though some people don't know, but you can hear that I am pretty bummed. I'm sad. <laughs> I'm I'm just like, eh. I, I just did it just to do it, but. I, I am very appreciative of that series, mainly because it made me meet some uh, pretty good people and everything. I am just hoping that those people didn't leave so then I can keep on doing what I do for them because I do want to make people smile. I do want to make people laugh. I want to get people out of that void, even though I'm still in it because nobody needs to be in there. But yeah. So I'm coming back. Uh, another little thing. I know this, I'm making this pretty fucking long. I'm sorry. But um, I will also be doing a lot of live streams as well. Uh, I'm going to be doing them on Twitch. Uh, I can't do them on YouTube yet because I got to figure that out. But I'm going to be doing live streams on Twitch right now. Uh, so if you guys want to follow me there, um, go to Twitch. Cyclone Hunter 21. Not 18 for Twitch. It's 21. Because I'll be recording them for my Xbox. If you guys want to check them out, do it. I'll probably be recording sometime in the afternoon almost every day, if I can. Um, but if you guys want a little, I guess, a bit more updates and stuff like that, I'd recommend following me on Facebook as well. Because on Facebook, I am uploading some of my videos there as well. Not all of them, just some. And I will be doing little updates here and there with the uh, live stream, saying when I'll go live, all that stuff. Or if I will be live today or not. I'm gonna just say high fi to the Facebook people on this, because uh, I did not expect for y'all to give me a um, lot more views on some of the videos I've uploaded on there than my damn YouTube channel. I did not expect that. So, hey, I was wrong about Facebook. That's pretty cool. All right, well, that's all I gotta say. Um, so, if anything, hopefully there will be some videos on the 13th. If not, I'll send an update to Facebook. Um, but yeah, no, I just want to say, again, uh, thank y'all for sticking this long with me. If you guys are still subscribed and just waiting for me to upload something, I just want to say thank y'all, because it does mean a lot to me. So, yeah, alright, well, peace everybody, have a good night.